This is Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on how to use Evernote from your BlackBerry. Now, if you're a fan of Evernote, it's great to be able to use it from your BlackBerry device. I've put a link to the Evernote site in the show notes, where you can sign up for a free account if you don't have one, and also a link to the software. With the software installed on my BlackBerry, I'm going to click the trackball. Now, Evernote makes it very simple to use from a BlackBerry device. You have four options. You can do a text note, you can send a snapshot, you can record an audio note, or you can upload a file. So I'll show you an example of a text note. We'll put in a title, no pun intended there, and you put in the body of your message. You can select which notebook from your collection you want to put it in. Mine all go to incoming content. You can also select from existing tags. So I'll highlight that and just say apps, say save, and now I'll click the BlackBerry menu key, say save note, it's starting the upload, it uploads the note, shows you upload finished, and we're done. And that note is now in my Evernote database on the web, on my PC, on my Mac. Snapshot, probably self-explanatory. Audio note, press the trackball, then you can press the trackball again to record. So I'll record this message, then I'll say stop, then I click the BlackBerry menu again, say save note. I can put in a subject for the note. I'm going to keep this simple. And I'm going to say save note. You can see it's uploading one of one note of one. Uploads finished. And just like that, my audio note is in my Evernote database as well. And the same is true of uploading a file. You just highlight upload a file. You can browse your BlackBerry. Pick the file you want. And you're done. And then lastly, there's a search, so that you can search all of the content of your Evernote databases. So, this is using Evernote on your BlackBerry, and that's all there is to it.